everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Leanne and welcome to Leanne's Life. Today I'm excited to be a part of this Hocus Pocus collaboration. We are bringing you everything Halloween. This collaboration is hosted by the wonderful Shauna from Mrs. Dickinson 1910. Please make sure to check out her channel. I will leave the link below along with the playlist. Today I am making for you a witch's brew that is an adult beverage and also bad to the bone buffalo chicken dip. So if you are interested in these types of videos, anything from cooking, shopping hauls, grocery hauls, um, anything lifestyle related, make sure that you subscribe to my channel and click that notification bell so you're notified each and every time I upload a video. Also, be sure to check the playlist down below in my description box so you can watch all the other wonderful YouTube ladies that have come together for this collaboration and you can see what they have created. So now let's get into my witch's so I'm gonna link the full recipe below, but I am only gonna be making a quarter of it because we don't need to drink that much tonight. So I'm gonna start with two cups of cranberry juice. And I'm putting it in a pitcher, but you could get creative. You could put it in a witch's cauldron. You could put it in a fancy bowl, a punch bowl. But I'm just putting it in this pitcher for now. Next, you're gonna need a half a cup of vodka. And then you're gonna need two and a half cups of a lemon lime soda. I'm using 7-Up. and then just mix it up. You could put ice in this if you have it on your table and people are gonna drink it right away, but I don't wanna water it down, so that's why I didn't put any ice in this. And then you can get a fancy cup, decorate them somehow to look very spooky and scary, and then just serve this over ice. So this is what you're going to need to make my good to the bone buffalo chicken dip. So you're going to need some pizza dough, um, a can of chicken breast or just cook up some fresh chicken breast, some cream cheese, some hot sauce. This hot sauce is just as good as Red Hot. I personally love it. This is from Aldi. You need some ranch, and I like to put in celery, carrots, and onion in my buffalo chicken dip. So the first thing you're gonna do is chop up, chop up all your vegetables. I know a lot of people do not put vegetables in their buffalo chicken dip, but I personally like the texture, the crunch. Um, it's gonna cook for a good couple of hours, so these will get soft. They will not be completely hard. That's why I chop the carrots up pretty small, um, so they cook quicker. But I personally love the texture of them in the buffalo chicken dip. So next you're gonna need a block of cream cheese, about a cup of ranch dressing, I start with a half a cup of buffalo sauce and then I just add some in to taste and uh, drained and 
I um, shred up the chicken from the can. And then we're gonna put all of this into the crock pot. So I have a small crock pot here and I just have it on low. And all of these measurements are for about a half a serving or a half a batch of this buffalo chicken dip. If you're making it for a party, I would definitely double it. So here is the final product, the breadsticks as bones, the buffalo dip. It is so cute. Great to serve at a Halloween party for sure. Thank you for watching everyone. Make sure to check out Shauna's channel and the playlist below in my description. Until next time, bye everyone.